Hi, this is Dr. Nadim and my research assistant Rafi. We are from Factum Illuminari and we uh, are more known as the bare naked engineers. Today, we are going to present to you an easy method of boiling water to produce drinking water. And uh, we're going to do it by while we're cooking rice. We call it the two pot disinfector, right? And it's a very simple process. But while we're cooking rice, we're going to use the heat of the rice to boil the water or to disinfect the water and so that we can produce drinking water. And the cool thing about this process is it does not require more energy than is required to cook the rice. And in Bangladesh, because we make cook two meals a day of rice, we can produce sufficient uh, drinking water from this process to meet the demands of the family, thereby preventing the spread of uh, waterborne diseases. Right? And uh, we're going to proceed on to show you the, the methodology. Rafi, how much money are we spending now in Bangladesh in terms of natural gas use for boiling water? So he was found in a paper called the Daily Stirs. Uh, they conducted the research throughout the Bangladesh and uh, the PIB. They have found out that uh, just for uh, boiling water purpose, every year in Bangladesh, there's uh, the 332 crores amount of tata of natural gas is being spent every single year. So hopefully our process will do the same thing without having to spend the energy. So household without having to utilize this energy, while they cook in their rice, they can produce drinking water. Thank you. So what we're doing here is we're cooking rice. All right. So this is for a family of four. So we're cooking enough rice to feed the family of four. And while we're cooking the rice, we're going to also disinfect the water by putting another pitcher containing the water within there. So what's happening now is as this heats up, it will evaporate the water while it's cooking the rice. And the evaporated water will go up and hit and condense against the pot. The pot is acting like a lid. And then the heat, latent heat of the water will get transferred to the water on top. So this uh, pan or this pot is full of water, which we want to make it disinfect by raising the temperature. What we have found out that once the rice is cooked, the temperature of this pot, we have measured it by using a thermometer and Rafi was doing it. Rafi, come over and he's measuring the temperature here. So what we found out that within 20 minutes of operation, right, meaning that when the rice is cooked, it took about 20 minutes, then what happened is that the temperature rose above 70 degrees, right, to 70 to 75 degrees. And when this happens, that at above 70 degrees and to up to 75 degrees, most of the pathogenic bacteria, which causes diarrhea, giardia, in fact, giardia as well, and cholera, that gets killed off. So then what you have is the water which is portable, meaning drinkable. But in the context of Bangladesh, we want to also ensure, we, around every household will have a thermometer. We want to bring it to a ro rolling boil. So that's very simple. After the temperature heats up to the to that level, that is 70, 75 degrees, the rice is being already cooked. What we do is we take the pan off and put it into direct heating. And what we found out that within a couple of minutes, about three minutes of heating, the water comes to a rolling boil. Once it comes to a rolling boil, all pathogenic microorganisms, bacteria and viruses get killed off. And then what you have is you have water that can be drunk. Okay, a portable water, you can drink that water. So what this does this mean? It means that we are producing water with minimum drinking water with minimum amount of, of energy required. So while we're cooking rice, we can make possible drinking water.